Well, good day, Glap here. Welcome back and thanks for checking back in. A mongrel dog can be defined as a dog of mixed breed. I call this tour our mongrel tour of southern Thailand because this is one very shaggy lineup. On this one we have me, Paul, often known as Glab, from Australia, a dark side rider on a Harley. We have Palmy from Iceland, a dark side rider also on a Harley. Olivier, aka the Froglodyte, a dark side rider also on a Harley. Rutka from Belgium, Black Sheep MC on a BMW. Joachim from Germany, Black Sheep Support on an Indian. And finally, but not least, Johnny from Australia, Support to both on a Harley. Now you can see why I call us mongrels. Around southern Thailand we go, 3,500 kilometres over 12 days, for most of us anyway. We'll break this mongrel tour into many videos so I don't bore the shit out of you. Happy days. Day one, 4.30 a.m. start. We all meet up at the PTT on the Sukhumvit on the 3 at 5 o'clock. We head up to Bangkok, which I must say I was dreading, um, so we got to get across that ferry nice and early. And surprisingly, there was not a great lot of traffic that slowed us up too much. Rolled straight onto the ferry and away and across the other side. And before we knew it, best time ever through Bangkok, normally it's crap, we're out the other side and heading down the coast. We stuck to the coast road, we cut off the major highway, uh, off the four, and stuck to that coast road as hard as we could, which is just beautiful following it down the beach, and ended up that night in Pratchip Kirikan, about 440 kilometres for day one. It was a great ride. We're at the meeting point, it's 5am. Joachim's over there filling up his uh, Indian chief. It's my heritage, Palmy's Road Glide, John's new Pan America, Rutger and his big GS, his Beamer, and uh, Olivia on his fat boy. Six of us on this ride, happy days. We are on our way towards Bangkok on the 3, 6.34 in the morning. We're now in Bangkok, trying to navigate our way through the usual crappy Bangkok traffic. I'm gonna do that with being good boys, doing nothing illegal. I'm gonna go over the ferry because bikes can't go over the big bridge because the tyres can't tell the difference between a big bike and a scooter. Talk about lucky, we just rolled up straight onto the ferry. It hasn't been too painful at all going through Bangkok this morning. We've just stopped for coffee number one. We've cleared Bangkok. We've had a fantastic run through Bangkok. We're all astounded that it was so easy this morning. Easiest time ever. Thank Christ for that. Got off the highway south of Bangkok and we're just following the coast road down the coast on the western side of the Gulf of Thailand. You can see through here there's salt flats both sides. They harvest salt here. They just pump salt water in and they evaporate it dry and they roll it and then I've been along here before you'll literally see hundreds and hundreds of Thai people out there with shovels and buckets digging it out and that's the way they do it that's the way they farm salt here turning into Phuk Tian Beach just to stop for a drink got heaps of time today so not in a hurry just to relax What a cool spot, stopped on the coast, We're about 20 odd kilometres north of Cha Am, There's boardwalk here, little restaurants all along the way, many of them closed, the waterfront. Cha Am's about 20 kilometres south of us, where the camera's pointing now. Stop for another coffee, tea, whatever, drink. Cool. We're taking a bit of a detour, trying to find the, I think it's Say Caves. So the road to nowhere. The road into a cave. Flat out, straight into a rock wall. Wouldn't be the first time you've nearly done that. Me? 
Oh, how nice is this? It's truth, mate, it's nice. Kalsam Roy Yacht National Park, Side Cave. And two price Thailand. Thai adults 40 baht, Thai adults 200 baht. So five times the price for a Farang. Bloody disgraceful. We're just departing from the Sai Cave. The National Park, just looking beautiful along the waterfront here. The little diversion we took was well worth it. About 50 kilometres outside Pratchip Kirikan, where we're staying tonight. Pretty nice roads, we're just off the coast too. Ah, rolling towards Pratchip Kirikan, where we're staying the night. I don't know how many k's we've done today, 400 odd. Rolling along the beachfront here, quite pretty. Nice sea breeze too, it's cooled down a lot. Just monkeys all over the side of the road here. Hundreds and hundreds of them. So that's day one. Stand by for day two onwards when I get my sorry ass onto it. Happy days.